There isn't much things better than when you're a teenager and you can go to bed when you want, you can wake up when you want, you can do whatever you want when you want, right? Not really any schoolwork to do. Your parents can't really tell you anything. Yeah, the school can bother you, but they can't really give you any detention, especially not anytime soon, right? So life is perfect. You've been kicking back and relaxing for the last two months at least, right? And to be honest, you can probably do that for another two to three months until things go back to normal, whatever that may be. But let me ask you a question. What do you think the impact will be when you go back to school for being lazy over the last six months? What do you think the result will be? I tell you something, you're probably going to struggle. You're going to have to develop a new habit, new routine. You're going to have to pick up the information faster than you've ever done before. And it's probably going to cause a lot of stress, fear and overwhelm, right? You're going to feel a huge amount of pressure to do well or at least get back to where you could have been anyway. So I want to share this quote with you. It's easier to maintain than it is to regain. Yes, I know it's cliche, but it's true, right? It's easier to to maintain than it is to regain. So I don't really care if you haven't done anything yet. But what I do care about is what you're going to do from this point and moving forward. So we need you to take the first step. Maybe it's just logging into your school platform and checking the schoolwork. Maybe it's bringing up the school to ask for some paperwork or book you need help with, right? Whatever that is, we have to be able to take the steps because by the time you go back in September, we want to make sure that we are ready. I don't want you to go back and be all stressed. I don't want you to go back and struggle. But we have to start now this is absolutely key and if you start now you will make progress i'm not asking you to spend a hundred hours a week i'm not asking you not to watch netflix not to go on your game not to go on your phone i'm not asking you to do that but just remember it's easier to maintain than it is to regain and that's the best way for you to avoid a huge amount of stress whenever things do go back to normal anyway until then i'm out